Hey guys, this is Roger from Hemajoys.net. I've got the Desire S on the left here and the original Desire on the right here. Um, the original Desire is running Android 2.2 and the new Desire S is running on Android 2.3.3. Um, I've cleared the clash, the clash, I meant the cache, uh, just to make it fair. Um, we'll go into bookmarks and get started and see which one's faster. Um, we'll start off with Hemajoys and see which one loads. So one, two, three. The original Desire's got a head start, oddly enough, and the new Desire S is loading up the pictures quicker. It could go either way. And the original, nope, the Desire S was com completed it first. You can see the original Desire is still doing the stuff. Um, let's try another website. And this time we'll try out Engadget and see which one loads, loads quicker. So initially it looks like the original Desire is going quicker. Like you can see it's loading up stuff first. And the Desire S has won again just by a few seconds. Let's give, out, give another website a try. We'll try BBC News this time. Start on both at the same time. <clears throat> and looks like the original desire is off to a head start. So which one's gonna win? And it was the original desire. So it's a little odd here. Um, the Desire S is using newer hardware. It's using the second generation Snapdragon processor. But for some reason, it seems that it can go either way. On that one, you saw the original desire loaded up the bbcnews.co.uk um, website much quicker. Well, let's see pinch to zoom and double tap. So the original Desire is pretty, pretty good. There's no lag there. Let's see on the Desire S. Not bad either. It's pretty much the same. I wouldn't say there's a big difference. Let's try a double tap. Yep, there you go. It's zoomed in quickly and it's reflowed the text. Let's try it on this. And I've accidentally clicked, clicked on a link. But you can see it's pretty much the same in terms of reflowing text. And it's a bit of a hit and miss when it comes to which one loading the web pages quicker. Anyway, I'll leave it at that. This was Roger from Hemadres.net. Take care.